Hey everyone, Mobius, Anticora, here, bringing you what I was hoping was going to be a short video, ended up being something much greater than I expected it to be. Something happened earlier tonight in the Moss Eisley Cantina that upset me a little bit. So this video is going to be along the same lines as my Griefer video, and I think I may mention that once or twice in the actual clips. I expect to get a lot of flame comments on this one as well. A lot of people are probably going to disagree with my opinion on this, but if you were there, you understand why I'm posting this and why my opinion is the way it is. So go ahead and let's start the clip. Hey everyone, Mobius1 here making a quick public service announcement. Um, as you can see, good friend Cora decided to fly all the way back out here to Moss Eisley to help buff the noobs because uh, there were no entertainers in the city uh, buffing so she was here for probably like about five ten minutes and after which our good old AFK bat buff bot Lulu decided to sign in she saw Takora dancing here kind of gave her a walk around you know, examine the situation, and uh, after a careful analysis, decided to stand right in front of her view, I guess, and start up her own macro, essentially blocking Takora's uh, line of sight to invite people that sit in the chair. Now, you know, I kind of, I tried to get her attention from Mobius, determined... You know, was not getting, or uh, noticed I wasn't getting any sort of response, no reaction whatsoever. Kind of figured that she had ad ignored me. Switch to an alt, and let's read some of the chat, shall we? So, it's important to know that that's really all I wanted to record. Uh, we had planned on, you know, not sticking around on Tatooine. The only reason we were there, I mean, here we're on Tatooine Mining Outpost right now, and the only reason. Takora was even on Tatooine earlier today was because, like I said in the clip, there were no entertainers there. I was on Tatooine when I signed in, and people were running all around the cantina looking for an entertainer to buff them, so I asked Tick if she would mind to come down there and buff, because Ilulu was not there. Um, so she did, and, and then things got a little bit worse. Um, seeing as how she had responded so negatively, I had taken it upon myself to start inviting people to Tick's group for her. So as I saw people come into the cantina to uh, to get their buffs, before they could get s before they could reach the chair and sit down and get invited by Lulu, I would send them a manual invite to to Takora's group. And things were going a little bit well until uh, until this happened. So I switched over to one of my artisan all to I haven't really well, actually I can't say I haven't leveled him much but he's a master artisan anyway so I switched over to him figuring you know this is a character that she probably wouldn't have ignored I'm not even in Moss Eisley on this character so I sent her a tell hey are you buffing just to see if I'd get a response uh, she said yes so I asked her in front of another buffer just to see if she'd be honest which she said yes uh, so I tried to ask her that was there before you that's pretty low to be honest because at this point she wasn't responding right away can't you find your own spot so she responded I'm here almost 24 7 so like okay that didn't really answer the question but if you want to use that as an argument so I responded but you weren't and someone else was so you're just being rude to which she responded yes so I asked her why. And her answer is because she has over 400 emails that love her being there. That's why. 400 emails. Isn't that a little bit... It, I don't know if ironic is the word that I'm looking for, but it's ironic that she's got... According to her, and I'm being very generous even calling it a her, because let's be honest, 90% of all... 99% of all female characters in MMOs are dudes anyway. <sighs> Her excuse for doing this is that 400, at least 400 people 
love her so much to send her emails saying what a great job she's doing. And here she is doing the exact opposite of what those people probably expect her to be doing. Like, she's proving the point against herself. So yeah. We, we've been kind of going back and forth about this the past couple of days, like where Takor is going to be buffing. Uh, I know I've done two videos now saying at first she was going to be in Mos Eisley and then she was going to be in Dantooine. After this, I have no idea where she's going to be, but if you want to add her to your friends list, just type slash add friend a space and then Takora, T-I-C-O-R-A-H. Send her a message if you see she's online, because she's online more often than not, and most of the time she's at her keyboard when a Lulu is not. So, this is, honestly, this is just as bad as my griefer video. Like, these are the type of people that are just a drain on the in-game community. They have subpar societal standards than the rest of us, and quite frankly, they don't deserve our business or our attention. So, if you can at all help it, I recommend avoiding a Lulu, maybe ignoring her yourself. I mean, if you're on Tatooine and she's the only one around buffing, go ahead and, you know, get the buff, but I wouldn't tip her. Or it. Um, I know I won't be from now on. Alright guys, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time. Again, that was all I wanted to record. I thought that would be the end of it, we would continue, you know, for a couple more minutes or whatever, buff a few people and call it a night, go play another game. Nope. So here we are about an hour later, and I don't know who this guy is, but some guy who overheard what was going on in the cantina named Tuna Fish Sandwich uh, decided to block the Lulu's line of sight in response to her blocking Takora's line of sight. So, thank you, buddy. You are a good friend. All right. Think that was the end? No. Not even close. And about another 45 minutes to an hour later, it looks as if Alulu hired some giant Wookiee named Elieg, who probably was just created, uh, to come do the same thing to Takora. However, uh, it's proving to be super ineffective because I am the group leader, and I am the one sending the invites, not Takora. What a benefit it is to have friends, and to actually be active at your computer instead of running an AFK macro all damn day. <sighs> People. Oh, what a night, fellow viewers. I don't know who did this, but somebody just came in with the name of their character name, Elulu is a meanie. And someone else is here, Elulu is rude, blocking her view. I, I just... I love you guys. Takora loves you guys. Un unmute yourself, just say thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright. So there you go. I mean... <laughs> I thought I was going to get to do something productive tonight on the... <laughs> instead, I'm doing this. But I'm having just as much fun. What? It's just so silly. Like... I don't, I just don't understand it. Like, I do something nice. I, no one's well, here. Now she's cheering for it, too. <laughs> and, like, I come to buff, and then I've j I just can't believe how rude people are. So much for your 400 emails now of people that love you. I mean, <laughs> really. <laughs> oh, God. Well... I mean, the sad thing is, I really... I don't enjoy doing this. No, I mean, honestly, it's... What's bad bad about it is, it's a kind of waste of time, because I'd rather be doing, you know, either something else in-game or a different game, but instead, I feel like I'm taking on societal's woes by, like, not letting bullies, like, run over other people. Yeah. It's just... It's sad.
So, I mean, it's not like I got on tonight and was like, hey, you know what I want to do? Let's go, you know, have a cantina fight with another entertainer. No. Yeah, I mean, this isn't exactly fun. It has provided itself funny moments. But, and honestly, I've gotten to optimize my macro a bit, so thank you, Ilula. Ilulu. La la bird, whatever the hell your name is, because you've Look, been a pain in the yeah, butt. This is perfect. Her, her macro still says buffing at the keyboard 90% of the time. She's not here 90% of the time. She's no. here like 15% of the time, She's maybe. She's never here. Like, it's ridiculous. Yeah. And this Sfaso guy keeps declining my group invite. So let them. I don't care if they want to go to her. Half the time people go to bots because they know they're not there and they don't have to feel guilty about tipping them or not tipping them. So I don't, you know, it's not a matter of whether or not anybody wants to be in my group or not. I don't care. I'm not that, you know, I don't take it that personally. It's just that when I am here and she's here, I respect her space, you know, yeah. and it's not like I moved in on her space. Like no one was here. I came in at the request of some viewers, and then she comes in, and we're like, hello, we're here, and she's like, yeah, you know, we're going to do whatever. Aw. Chewbacca just gave me a thousand credits. <laughs> people's, the stuff people say, too, are hilarious. Oh, uh, now our group's full. And that's how you get a full group, people. Yeah. And guess what? She's still not getting people into her group. No, I guess she's getting some. Hey, she can have whoever is available. Like, I don't... I'm not trying to kill her. It's just... No, I'm not either. But thanks, Ren. Um, it's just wrong. Like, I... Uh... It's just, it's a very good psychological experiment to know how much of how you act in real life, like, puts itself into a game. Like, I just would never be so ignorant. And I did not expect this video to be this long. Like, when I first recorded, you know, the first thing that happened, I thought this was going to be like a two-minute video, like, hey, this happened this one time. And now it turned into this whole thing. We've got, like, a crowd of people watching. And a full group. I was expecting to play Elder Scrolls tonight. This is ridiculous. Me too! <laughs> <laughs> really? You see what you did? I mean, I don't want to give her the credit of thinking like she ruined our night because obviously oh, no. we would just choose to go play a different game. But, I mean, I just, I just want to make sure she like feels the pain in her wallet tonight. That's all. Hugs and kisses. I mean, because really, that's all it's about. If she wanted to help the community, or she wanted to, you know... I, it's ridiculous. That's all I can say. If she wanted to help the community, she would have found a different chair or something when she saw you were there, but the fact that she stood in front of you is, del is just like the Griefer video. Again, it's... There's no Yeah, I don't own the chair. It. I don't own the chair. I guess you could stand in front of the chair. But right, like, it's not breaking any rules, but it's just, it's sub-standard as far as social courtesies is, are concerned. Yeah, it's just like, it's douchebaggery at its finest. That's it all is. it is. That's all it is. She's not breaking any rules. It's not like I'm going to report her on the forums, so I am going to post this video on the forums. Um, so if any of you are, are watching from the forums, hi. <laughs> but, uh... Oh, well. Maybe we'll go play Elder Scrolls now. Eh, I don't know. I feel surrounded by a bunch of big furry men is not a bad place to be as a Twi'lek. <laughs> this is probably the most excitement that's gone on here and I don't know how long. Five bookies. <laughs> Go home, Legion D. You're drunk again. <laughs> I just... I don't even... I don't even know what's going on here anymore. Q. 
Cantina Drama, Dancing Wookiees. People taking a break to hang out with me, apparently. This night has been fucking crazy. Pardon my basic. mother was a hamster, and your father smelled of elder... Elderberries. Elderberries. Ah, oh, I gotcha. I was like, what is that word? <laughs> of course, I can't do anything but a basic attack because I don't have buffs. No! Oh, I can't heal his mind. Oh, God. Someone's gonna die. Ah! Here we go. I saved you. <sighs> oh, it made me miss the invite. It, it was a diversion. <laughs> no! There's a whole bunch. You gotta get in there. I got them both. Clever girl. <laughs> I just said that. Every time I say a Lulu now, I'm going to think Cthulhu. TK got it. TK got it. <laughs> HP buff craft. <laughs> oh, smart people jokes. <laughs> Who is in the right, who is in the wrong. Um, if you think that sort of behavior is okay. Maybe if the griefers want to come back to this video and say that this is another form of competitive PvE. Like, who who does that? It's not competitive PvE. It's, it's just rude. Like, it's... I can't even... I have no clever analogies for this one. You know, if you watch my griefer video but you haven't checked it in a while, I suggest you go check it and read the analogy that I posted in the description, because about a day or two after I posted that video, I came up with the most brilliant analogy of the situation involving a grocery shopping cart. And, I mean, that, that just describes that situation perfectly. This one, I got nothing. This is just... There is absolutely no reason for her to do that other than to be greedy. So, if you disagree, let me know. If you agree, let me know. Hey, that'd be even better. I'd like to read those comments, too. But, uh, anyway, for those that were there, and those that uh, joined Tick's group, we both appreciate it. And, um, keep an eye open for her in the future. As of now, she's here in Dantooine Mining Outpost. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching, as always, and I will see you next time.